I would like to warmly welcome you to the Faculty of Agriculture, University of Peradeniya. We are the oldest and the leading Faculty of Agriculture in this country. We have a staff strength of about 137 cadre positions. Currently, there are 113 staff members, academic staff members serving this faculty. 75% of them have taken their PhDs from world leading universities and 50% of them are professors attached to eight different departments of studies. We have an annual intake of about 345 students at the moment. We offer three main degree programs, of course, the BSc in Agriculture that we started in 1948 is now being renamed as BSc Honours in Agricultural Technology and Management, which is the, the mainstream degree program of the faculty. We take about 221 students for that degree program. And then the BSc uh, Honours in Food Science and Technology. We are taking about 64 students for this program. And the, the youngest degree program uh, offered by the faculty is the BSc Honours in Animal Science and Fisheries. Uh, we take about 75 students at the moment. And uh, one of the unique features of the degrees offered by the Faculty of Agriculture is that when a student choose A-level biology stream, they have to forego many other disciplines like uh, commerce, economics, mathematics, and so on and so forth. But when students come to the Faculty of Agriculture, when they progress along our degree programs, they have the opportunity to diversify their careers because we are offering a vast array of subject areas. And in fact, we have state-of-the-art facilities, laboratory facilities. Recently, we introduced uh, this uh, skill laboratory, of course, you know, spending about 500 million rupees. You know, the funds came from the World Bank. And we have the best, I would say the best, Agriculture Biotechnical Center in our faculty and we always uh, try to promote you know, cultural, social cohesion also among our students and we have initiated recently a state-of-the-art language laboratory and we always you know, offer our students opportunities to learn second language so that they can enhance their cohesiveness among themselves. In our long journey of 75 years, of course, this year we are in the 74th year, and next year we are going to celebrate our Diamond Jubilee. In our long journey, we have immensely contributed to the development of the agriculture sector, agriculture as well as allied sectors of the country. And uh, to uh, name a few, of course, we have supported initiation and development of many other agriculture faculties in the country. And that can be one of the you know, main contributions I, I can uh, tell you. And uh, we have also introduced many educational innovations to the higher education system of our country. To name a few, we were the first to introduce the course unit system. We are the first to introduce the semester-based education system. We were the first to introduce uh, teach evaluation by students. And uh, the list goes, you know, it's a long list. And in fact, we are the first state sector faculty that introduced an integrated marketing communication campaign to promote our degree programs among potential students. In the Faculty of Agriculture, we take research seriously, both student research as well as staff research. In uh, 1975, the faculty introduced uh, the compulsory research component uh, to the undergraduate degree curricula. And uh, since then, many departments of studies have had their own research symposia to communicate the findings of the student research to the stakeholders. And in 2014, the faculty took a decision to initiate 
the force that is faculty of agriculture undergraduate research symposia the objective of this uh, faculty of agriculture undergraduate research symposium is to give the student an opportunity to showcase their capabilities to its various stakeholders such as the employers coming from the government sector the private sector and the ngos as well as the students and we have uh, had a series of successful symposia however unfortunately we were not able to hold the falls in 2021 so this this year therefore we have named the falls as faculty of agriculture undergraduate research symposia 2021 2022 this year there's a new addition also to the falls proceedings that is to open up certain competitions to the students from other universities both local and international we took the decision to allow our students to compete with their fellow students in other universities we are planning to gradually expand this uh, aspect of the force as well i would like to take this opportunity to thank the coordinator as well as the organizing committee of the force for staging the force 2021 2022 successfully amidst many challenges they faced due to the ongoing economic circumstances of the country and they did a, they have done a marvelous job and we must congratulate them for their achievement finally while wishing you all the very best i would like to invite you to enjoy the proceedings today